Welcome to the Analytical Chemistry Lab. This is pharmacist Simal Haris from the Faculty of Pharmacy, Middle East University. I'll be with you during this lab. To analyze what cation is present in a sample, we can carry out flame tests or add the appropriate reagents and observe the chemical changes. The group 1 ions that we will be testing for today include silver ion and lead ion. The metal ions of this group are separated as their insoluble chloride. As you see, silver ion is a colorless cation. Hydrochloride acid can be added for the testing. A white precipitate will be formed. We are then going to react the silver ion with the iodine solution to make sure that I have the right compound. If we will observe a pale yellow precipitate, so it is silver. Lead is also a colorless cation. A hydrochloric acid will also be used and a white precipitate will be formed. But we can also differentiate between these two ions by adding iodine solution. A dark yellow precipitate will be formed. Metals of analytical group number two are precipitated as sulfide in acidic media. This group includes copper ion. Copper ion is a blue ion. Can be identified by adding one mil hydrochloric acid and few drops of sodium sulfide. a black precipitate will be formed. The metal ions of this group are separated as hydroxide in basic medium. This group includes aluminum ion and ferric ion. To a solution that contains aluminum, add one mil of HCl, one mil of NH3, and 1 ml of NH4Cl. You will observe a white gelatinous precipitate will be formed. To a solution contains ferric, add 1 ml of HCl, 1 ml of NH3, and 1 ml of NH4Cl. Brown precipitate will be formed. To make sure that we have the right compound which containing ferric, we will do the following test. 1 ml ferric ion, 1 ml ammonium thiocyanate. We will observe. Thank you.